They call the United States the melting pot, if you will, because we are the place that has you know, cultures and, and races from everywhere throughout the entire world. One thing neat, unique about Hunter High School is that we have about 32 different cultures and we have even more languages here that are spoken. I really value race and I value culture and I value ethnicity, but I don't really notice it unless I choose to notice it. I don't think it matters as far as where they come from as long as they set their goals to be successful. A hard worker is a hard worker regardless of what race they are. Ignorance and close-mindedness. We're very afraid sometimes of change, of things that are different. People who really kind of classify that way and are like, oh, you're of a different race, therefore you're this, 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 and this, that's ignorance. They need to educate themselves and open their mind to the fact that they're not always right and be humble and willing to accept when maybe you make a mistake or maybe something like that happens because you'll never grow. You'll just be stuck in this stagnant state of ignorance and stupidity, really. We have gangs of every race. That they're, they're, that's what there are. A group of students who um, are of a specific culture decide to, to get together and that's their goal. If you ever get a group together that does something that does something negative, well that's not a positive thing for anybody in our community, nor our school. A lot of people just get so stuck in their way of thinking. Like they have been raised a certain way or they believe something, it's been ingrained in them, and instead of opening their minds and being like, hey, there might be value in um, learning about a different culture or value in somebody else's point of view, they take on the mentality, I'm right, you're wrong. Every student are different in their own way and it has nothing to do with race and culture. It has to do with more with skill and how we're, the way we are and our body styles are different no matter what race we are. No one is better than anyone else, period. We're all just different. And that doesn't, by being different, that just means we're awesome in different ways. It's important to, to know your culture, know where you come from, and still try to, to live in those values and that tradition. That's very important because that's what makes us all unique. We try to promote was tolerance, and that's tolerance for everything, not just race, but also religion and um, gender and things like that. The thing is, is there's always stuff to learn, and there's always stuff that needs to be understood. And there's always a different point of view that deserves to be valued. When you get people from different groups together, and whether it be different cultures, religions, or anything, and you all go towards one cause, that's what makes you want and, and be successful as far as your goals. People are people. We have to be open and we have to educate our children that it's okay to be different. It's okay to be who you are and it's okay to be different. All students at Hunter High School, they come and they realize that we have a goal to, to reach and it's all a similar goal and then we are all students, we're all Hunter High Wolverines rather than different groups and, and if we can do that and become more of a culture and, and a community, that's going to be the best for us all. We're all different, we've got to figure that out and accept it and then go on from it.